Hi everyone. Thank you for coming back to my channel. It is my 14 week update today. Sorry about trash truck in the background. It's 2-ish. Gabriel just woke up from his nap. The moment you fell, you could start over new Was the same that you realized the stories were true You opened your eyes and the world you could see It wasn't dim, it was brighter, you'd have to agree And he gets an episode of Trash Truck before we have to go. Hi. I was born for this game. Love it. Uh, so, like, what you're hiding, Gucci Pie. Anyway, so I'm giving you my 14 week update. Lots of nausea, but also, like, weird food aversion combo is causing the eating thing to be very difficult because like I have and want to eat healthy food but I have to be in the mood for it otherwise it makes me feel more sick or I just can wait until like I'm so hungry that I just have to eat by that time it's usually dinner time and that's not really a healthy approach so it's kind of been difficult so I'm trying to have more healthy foods on hand that I want to eat like that are easy to prepare or that are pre-prepared, like pre-washed fruit or that kind of thing. I feel otherwise a lot clearer, as I've been mentioning in my past couple of videos. My mental like fogginess has really gotten like a lot better. Last week I felt really productive and I did some stuff but not a ton. And this week not only have I felt really productive so far, but I've been really productive, especially like today specifically. It is Monday and not Sunday just because Yesterday was busy. I had a really busy weekend. Tons of excuses, but I'm here. Um, this week, the baby is the size of a pear, which is super fun. And we got lots of good updates. I don't know. I'm just... Things are good. We've been walking, staying healthy. I didn't work a ton last week. I only had like one shift last week just because of a scheduling error. And... It was really, really nice. And this week, I worked two shifts, but they're in the middle of the week, and we canceled the practice today because it's like 100 degrees out, and there's no AC in our theater, so we don't have practice, but Gregory and I are still going to go over, like, lines and practicing and everything like that, and we've just kind of, like, I don't know, I feel a lot more motivated to be able to do stuff like that. I have a little bit more energy at night, but I've been trying to get stuff done during the day, especially with the help of my sister since they're here, um, trying to make, like, keep up on all those little things so that they don't pile up and become a pain or become like whatever so that I don't get overwhelmed and then at night I don't have much to do and I can just sit down and relax and be as tired as I want and go to sleep and wake up and feel good. Um, which has helped a lot. Gabriel has also been sleeping in his bed through the night. Uh, he's been going to bed a little later like 8 39 but he hasn't been waking up until like 8 a.m. which is a fine trade-off for me quite honestly because if I can sleep until I wake up and then he gets up, that is wonderful. Um, and I've just kind of been letting myself sleep because I don't typically nap in the afternoon just because afternoons are really hard with work and everything to time that out. And usually when he's napping, I'm trying to clean things up. But I'm hoping once I get totally caught up in all the little like tasks that I have to do, that I'll have more time to do less chores during the day. Um, my water intake has been lower than I want it to be, quite admittedly. I'm struggling with it. With it being hotter, I'm trying to drink more oh. water glass on me, having bottle of water, bottles of water available to me wherever I am. 
which has helped some, but it's still not Ow. perfect. Ow. Overall, Ow. my back hurts a lot, and it's not fun. I don't love that. I'm, I'm kind of thinking that. of going, <laughs> I can't take them, of going to the chiropractor every two weeks instead of, or maybe every three weeks instead of once a month, just so it's a little bit more frequent. Whoa. But we'll see what my chiropractor says when I see him in July. I think I see him on the 1st of July. I have felt like I felt more like pushing up on my organs upwards, like especially on my stomach, which has not helped like queasiness at all. Um, and more like joint pain and things like that. Right here. I didn't have a full lunch today, so I don't feel great. I feel kind of queasy right now. But I have been eating. So I'm just going to kind of continue to eat and snack instead of doing like the full lunch and, and maybe when we get home I'll take a nap. And maybe when we get home I'll take a nap. We'll have to see yet. But like I said, it's like 100 degrees outside and I think because most of the time I'm cold, when I'm hot it's too hot. Anyway, so let's do it. Oh. 240, 2.40, we're gonna leave in two minutes. I'm so tired, but thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed, and we will see you next time for the next update. Love, Genevieve.